That should hold them for now. You put up a good fight out there. Hey, Dad. I'm glad you made it out. Joan's probably looking for us. No, she isn't. Javi shot her. What? Good riddance. You were negotiating. I heard you. You didn't have to shoot. Everyone started panicking and shooting. Joan doesn't deserve your pity. Think how many people have starved because of her. How many people lost their families and homes because of her. Killing Joan was the only way to stop it. You didn't stop it. You made it worse. Javi's right. Joan had to go. I would have done it too. That's because you don't mind killing people, do you? Those dead guys, they were your friends. Gabe, that's not fair. Hey, you do not walk away from me. When someone speaks to you, you stand up and answer them, even if you don't want to. David, that's enough. He's not a little boy. He doesn't need that from you. What he needs is to learn to keep his opinions to himself until he understands what the hell he's talking about. I'm just... I'm trying to protect you, Gabe. I lost you once. I won't let it happen again. Okay? We made it through alive. Let's just be glad about that. We need to check the other entrances. Make sure we're safe. Gabe, want to help me out? Javi? Gabriel! Just be careful, buddy. A lot of muertos out there. Gabe and I will watch each other's backs. I'll help too. O okay. Hey, Clem's with them. It's fine. It's not that. It's... let's just... <sighs> I'm all over the place. I need to focus on something. Anything. Just need to focus. On whatever. Let's just go upstairs. The further we are from these doors, the happier I'll be. I just want to get as much distance between us and the muertos as I can. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Oh my god. This is a fucking nightmare. Mommy, it's them. I'm glad Mariana didn't live to see this. To see what her father's become. To see what I've done. She'd be just like that little boy. Scared that the monsters are coming after her next. She would never trust us again. And I wouldn't blame her. Leave Mariana where she is. In peace. In the past. How many children became orphans today because of us? How many parents are now childless? I did this to them. That hole is there because of me. This is all my fault. I'm just as responsible for it as you are. You weren't behind the wheel, Javi. It's different. I can't leave until I make this right. All of this. Let's fix this as best we can. Really? I thought you hated this place. All you've tried to do is get out. These people, they didn't ask for this. Just like we didn't ask to lose Mariana. We couldn't do anything about that. But maybe we can do something about this. You've got a lot of nerve showing up here, after the bullshit you pulled. 
You're unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. After everything Joan's done, the looting, the lies, the blood she spilled, someone had to stop it. I shot her for the good of everyone here. Even you. There was nothing good inside her, and you knew it. So, why did you tell Joan what we were doing? I was triaging a bad situation. Their doctor is dead. And before you guys fucked it up, their walls worked. It's not only about me. I can actually save lives here. Not just ditch them up and hope for the best. These people will die without me, Javi. I know she, well, fucked us over, but she's trying to help them. She's trying to make something right. That's worth forgiving, right? She's trying, that counts. Eleanor is one of us. Maybe she forgot it, but I haven't. Thank you, Javi. We should try to help. Not everyone here is guilty. Did you see a little girl out there? She was right behind me. I'm sorry. I haven't seen any little girls. First Rufus. Oh, my baby girl. She knew Rufus. He was her husband. Until you shot him in the back. She's one of my people, Eleanor. What's going on with her? She'll be all right. She's not bitten or anything. She lost her daughter out there. I know. I'm so sorry. Christ, there's nothing worse than losing a child. Tell me about it. Give her some privacy. It's the least we can do. I want to help you. Okay, well... What the... We're all fucking dead because of you! Hey, easy. You We're... blew a hole in our wall! Got my little girl killed! Richmond was fine until your stupid Easy ass showed up. We're dead fucking meat, David. Might as well take out this asshole while I can. Fern. Shut up! I didn't mean for this to happen. I'm so sorry about your daughter. You can apologize to her face in just a second. Stand down. That's an order. Kate, no! Fern, this is all because of me. I caused the explosion. I killed your daughter. Please, forgive me. It's my fault. Please. Please, forgive both of us. <laughs> no! Burn! Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh my god! Dad! You're welcome, Javi. That dead guy! David, what are you doing? This isn't right. David! Oh my god. This is unacceptable. Did you really need to break her arm? That wasn't necessary. Okay. Don't thank me. Uh... No! <laughs> David! Dave! I I I'm sorry. That was an accident. You were going to kill her. She was going for her gun. Look at her. Gabe, I'm... She can't even stand up. What the hell is wrong with you? It was over the line, Gabe. You're right. Gabe. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to do that to you. You know that. Why the hell are you all looking at me that way? They're just... They're scared, David. Of what? I'm protecting them. Why are you pointing a gun at us? So I'm all alone. Fine then. You people are on your own. I've seen that look in his eyes before. You should go after him.
David? What are you doing? Come on. Just take a step back. You wouldn't want to, you know, slip or something. Come over here. Or are you afraid of me too? I know the rest of them are. Right? I won't lie to you, man. You have been acting pretty scary. So you are afraid of me? You brought it on yourself, David. My wife, Javi. My son. They look at me differently. Maybe you're seeing them differently. I want to show you something. Stand with me. Uh, why the hell are you smiling? See that sewer line over there? Perfect placement for a trench. That hill about a hundred paces west of it. Sniper's wildest dream come true. I'm a soldier, Javi. I see this landscape like a painter sees a blank canvas. Like how you used to see a baseball diamond. I'm a soldier. This makes sense to me. I was made for this. I thrive in this. You've said some weird shit before, man. But that's your blue ribbon winner there. I didn't expect you to understand. A soldier isn't a husband. Or a father. A soldier is a soldier. Nothing else. Nothing. Nothing at all. Call yourself whatever you want. I still see you as my brother. That is kind of you to say, Javi. I wish... I wish I had your heart sometimes. I want to change, Javi. I always have. Really? All you ever tried to do was get me to change. <sighs> Only because I couldn't bring myself to do it first. It's the one war I could never win. And I'm wondering why. Is it because I don't know how? Or because it's impossible to change who you really are? There's a way. There always is. No matter how lost you are. You just have to keep looking until you find it. Looks pretty messy. For now. Maybe you're right. Maybe. Just gotta live long enough to find out. Just like with anything else. I did what you asked. You did. Thanks for that. So now will you step back? <laughs> sure. I found them! They're up here! Be careful, Javi. I ran into... He was still outside when we checked on the entrances. The muertos were everywhere. We got him inside just in time. So we let him in. There were so many muertos out there. Thank God you're okay, man. I... I was worried. Uh... Trip. About earlier. Yeah, about that. I ain't gonna punch you in the teeth. Though, I got every right. Really? Figured you'd put up a little bit of a fight. Oh, I'd love nothing more, but... I just... Can't shake this slippery feeling I got. Like I'm... Standing in shoes that don't quite fit. You picked me to die, and... Someone else did instead. Ain't sitting right. Not one bit. I don't know what to tell you, man. It was fucked up. No doubt. Top to bottom. I keep putting myself in your position. About Conrad, about all of this. Asking myself over and over again whether I'd do the same. I'd love to tell you I wouldn't. I really would. But I can't. If someone threatened my family, I'd shoot them in a heartbeat. Hell, I'd shoot them twice to make sure the lesson stuck. It's a complicated world. But at least there's people to share it with. 
Bygones? How about it? I'm in if you are. You bet. Bygones. Try not to piss me off again, please. There's so many. They're pouring in. It's even worse than you think. The streets are overrun. Nowhere to go except inside the buildings, and those smelly fuckers are beating down every door. We're sitting goddamn ducks here. Everyone in town is. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck have we done? So what do we do? I don't want to die up here. None of us do, Gabe. Stabilize the city. Figure out how to make it safer for everyone. I saw construction vehicles when we got the armored truck. We can use those to stop the Muertos, seal the breach, and save Richmond. That's over by the motor pool at the water tower. We could use the highway overpass to get to the water tower. Come on. Let's jump. Come on. It's an easy jump. <clears throat> Keep your eyes open, stay aware of your surroundings, all of you. Let's move out. When we found Kate earlier, she hugged you. Why do you think she hugged you? Why was that? Just wondering. You really want to know? Then ask her. She won't even make eye contact with me. We need to be careful up here or else the exact same thing will happen to us. Stay sharp and do not fire your guns. We're gonna be fine. That guy was all alone. We're not. Everyone hold back. Let Javi and I clear out these walkers. Good to go. Let's move. You okay, bud? When I was little, Dad used to ask me what I wanted to be when I was a man. And I pointed him. He always liked that. I thought he was such a great guy. It would always make him smile. Every time. David may not be perfect, but he's not the worst role model in the world. Maybe. Never be like your uncle. He told me that all the time. Don't be a man who relies on other people to solve your problems. Because then you're not a man at all. I used to think he was right. Not anymore, though, Javi. I can only hope I grow up to be like you. Oh, well, thanks, buddy. It means a lot. I'm sorry I never really said it before. I should have. Really, thanks a million. You're welcome, a million. You took such good care of me. Now we need to take care of Dad. He's the one that needs our help. <laughs> 